What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the Crawfish Crockpot. Yeah, we'll go with that. And I'm your host, Anything for Views. Mr. Frank Ocean has come out of hiding. Only one fucking week after I wrote an entire goddamn report on him. A 11-page report. Coincidence. I think not. Since I wrote that report, uh, Frank Ocean is like a cyst that grows on my back. I pretty much know everything about him. Christopher Edwin Cooksey was born in Long Beach, California. He's a singer, songwriter, producer, releasing two studio albums, Channel Orange in 2012, and we don't talk about that one here, Blonde in 2016. And the project that we are going to look at today, DHL, not really an album, but one of the singles, Tubi released on an album because it's kind of similar to the blonde album cover it looks like a polaroid kind of meme got the text and you, you get it you get it i start with a square uh 1000 by 1000 square template in photoshop and i loaded the original cover artwork in to work off of as a base and i guarantee these uh, little black symbols in the corner are the track list this is 100 track list four track four guarantee it someone's juggling porcelain bowls next door you can really use any color. It's not necessarily it has to be blue. I want pink because I like to diversify my content. You're going to want a Polaroid look for the middle part. So just get a square, make a white, duplicate it, make it a little smaller, put the picture in, clipping mask, boom. Easy Polaroid picture. A little fun fact for you. You're going to want to find a picture where you look cool in, but like, you know, you really want one that's going to be easy to cut out in the future. Desaturate the image, play with the contrast, play with how much you desaturate it, play with sizes and stuff. It's up to you, bro. You do you. Do you. Like, this isn't a step-by-step -step guide. It's just some outline, you know? You feel me? Realize that the entire background is black, so you really don't have to meticulously cut it out. You can just use the magic erase tool. Duplicate the PNG later and hold on to it. Keep it in our back pocket. We're going to use that later. The font that I found is Keep Trucking. Uh, I just pretty much Google Flower Power font. People wanted me to explain my reasonings and, like, my... The fonts that i find so there's for you people that want to know my my methods uh, since i'm lazy and i didn't know what the lightning like the lightning bolt bubble font thing that he used was i just used a bunch of strokes i just keep adding strokes and use different colors to give it a 70s feel because i feel like he's going for a old and nostalgic kind of vibe Ooh, nostalgia 64 hmm. now remember that png layer that i told you to hang on to click it drag it into the bottom corner Make it the same color as the background and draw a square around it. Put the square underneath the PNG layer. There you go, you got a nice little cutout so people know what track list you're on. With the other PNG layer, move the PNG above the text image so it looks like it's popping out. It looks like you're a good graphic designer, but it's very minimalist work to do, you see? Trick people, make it look like you did a lot when you really did a little. It's the goal for today. Now, since you're super lazy, you're gonna fill up the rest of the track list by just finding uh, PNGs of people and putting a co color overlay on them and putting it there. It's fine if you do that. I mean, this isn't my album cover. I'm not Frank Ocean, but if you if you want to go through the work and find every single picture of you and your friends, cut it out and put it there. You do you. You're better. You're better designer than me. But I had a time crunch to do this. 100%. There's gonna be 13 tracks because it's track four because that one's highlighted. So enjoy your upcoming 13 Frank Ocean tracks. That's pretty much it. That's a DHL for you. Time to get into the the fun part where. I say, I am working on new stuff, I promise. It's just because I started college, and college is, uh, that's taking up a majority of my time right now, and I don't want to fail, I guess is a good word. Um, but I definitely upped the budget. I'd like to think I upped the budget here, because I'm now recording in my college's sound studio. So I can talk loudly, but not too loudly, because there are classes going on. I have more stuff. I want to incorporate more video essays like I did with the Moses video i want to do maybe some worst to best uh videos coming in the future and definitely more album cover tutorials but not enough not enough interesting album art that i can like do graphic design with is coming out it's a lot of drawings and i can't draw but you guys feel me i mean if uh paid your bail if you said sorry to the family then i guess uh i guess we have to let you go and have a have a pleasant day mm -hmm.